Okay, welcome back to Simple Rockets 2, where we made, last time, we made this, uh, Atlas 5, which I'll show you a picture of what it's meant to be copying. Here it is. Oh, no. Here it is. So, yeah, that's what it's meant to be. It's nothing like it, so we'll get that off the screen. <laughs> See what happens. And, of course, it's night. Oh, wrong, wrong, um... Of course, it's night time. Which way do I normally head? East. That's the way I should be facing. Um, and something's changed to where the orientation... I used to fly that way, but I don't know. I don't know how it works. Anyway, I'm going to lock this direction, fire up the engines, and God, that is powerful. That is almighty powerful. I didn't even put any RCS thrusters on it. Right, we're going to go to the orbit. I was at the solid field gone. Oh wow. Them engines are not right. At all. That field did not last long in them solids. But we got pretty damn high. Hey, the, the, the engine's actually doing okay. I mean, are these tanks draining? These little ones. No, they're not. Maybe I have to make them um, drain as well. I mean, it's not going to be much extra, to be honest. But... See, that is rotated. Yeah, the camera view when you start has changed a bit. I don't know. But it used to orientate the other way around, so it got us a bit confused the last flight when I did the um, SpaceX launch. The Falcon Heavy launch. I um, actually went around the wrong way. Went around that way against the rotation of the planet. So, yeah. There's that. Coming up on 80 kilometers here. Um, this booster should should have run out of fuel by now. I'm sh these engines are really making this game a lot easier. Honestly, really making it a lot easier. It looks good from what I can see. It's in the dark. I'm not sure how these missions actually work. Um, I'm going to do more research into these ones. So I can um, do a bit of more professional launch. Because this is just uh, playing it by ear. Just messing around. Seeing how it goes. Right, I'm going to drop the fair. And... Nice. That's nice. Right, so... Oh, I should have made a manoeuvre. That's fine. It's completely fine. We'll just start burning slightly. There we go. This will run out of fear so soon enough anyway. And then we'll see how far the inner stage goes. I might want to head that up a little bit. So 
see how well this stage does. Oh, recenter. Hasn't got a lot of thrust, this. No, it has not got a lot of thrust at all. <sighs> yeah, it's a good job to check this, because um, this is not going... That is not going to make it. The second stage is rubbish. Let's get this right. Sentence. Liquid. Um. What is the difference? That's a lot more thrust. Okay. That need to be more. Actually, yeah, that increasing that is better. Right. And then we'll put that on there. I'll have to actually. that on there, to put that, oh, sugar, to put that on there, to put that on there, and let's just check the stage, and, oh, I'm, we need to change these, this feel Hydrolux Ah right and see what's happening here Fuel flow staged. One minute six. Burn time. Thrust to weight ratio. I think we'll go for that. Try that one. See if it looks good. And if it looks good, we'll see how powerful it is. Okay, we're gonna skip to the daytime though, because uh, I'm not launching in night again. Oh, there we go. Daytime. Nice. Right, so we're gonna lock our head in. We still didn't put thrusters on, um, RCS thrusters, but never mind. Ready, three, two, one. Wow. Should have really started like half thrust. <laughs> While we had the, um, now we'll power up, get rid of the boosters. I really don't like this fuel type because it doesn't look rockety. Does not look rockety. We're gonna have to but you know I really wish I had on these in this game the ability to put like flags and writing down the side of the rockets. That would be phenomenal actually getting up there pretty fast. 
surprised how well this is doing. Even th this is not meant to be an exact replica, by the way. It's um, I'm just kind of doing an example and just making a rocket that works. That's the main point. I'm gonna get this set up, this manoeuvre and whatnot. God. Come on. Get the sensitivity up. Come on. Go, go, go. Go. Put that back down. Right, auto burn. Oh. Arrival time, 63 seconds. Any time you want to start the burn, that'd be great. There we go, and it's off. See if the first stage actually lasts getting it into orbit. That'd be amazing. I think it's still got fuel in these. It has, but I'm not bothered about that. Should we drain these for extra fuel? See how much extra fuel it gives us? No. Let's just forget about that. There we go. This should be a lot more thrust than it was. I think it is, yeah. You can already see a difference. Just from how fast we're moving away from the first stage. There. What's the orbit looking like? Ah, it's getting there. 74%. It's probably going to be way off because of the having to do a new stage. But, it's looking good. Wing vectors. Hmm. That's new. Never seen that option. Ah, oh, come on. Yeah, it's going up now there, look. And it is a bit short, but we're, we're in orbit. That is pretty cool. Still got 50% fuel. That's mad. That is mad. So yeah, that worked pretty well actually. A little rocket. Shoots off at the start though, doesn't it? Yeah. Crazy. They've got um rent you heat on, yeah. Should we crash it? Let's crash it. We've launched it, now we'll crash it. Come on. Retrograde. Come on, me as well. Have some fun. Let's just keep burning. Let's keep burning. <laughs> So much power, this one, this thing. Might as well wait till all the fuel is drained. Just keep burning. Burning, burning, burning. Till we burn up in the atmosphere. I 
See, this is the right colour for the launch stage. The other colour is the right colour for the vacuum. I'm not 100% on the fuels yet, how they work and stuff. But it's pretty cool, all these procedural engine engines. Engines. Right, we're going to start burning or. I'm sure it has got re entry effect this game. I can't remember exactly. Is it going to do some effects or not? We'll just turn the lock heading off. Coming in pretty fast. Yeah, I don't think it has re entry <laughs> heat. It has the damage, but it doesn't have um, the heat. See and starting to lag. Three hundred meters per second into the ocean. Here we go. Nice. That's pretty cool. Though. Sick. Right, end the flight. Save an exit because I want to launch at the day time. But there it is, that's the Atlas V I've made, it's um, decent, not true to real life or anything, but yeah. So I think, what do I think, I think I'll wrap this up there, thanks for watching both parts of this video, and if you leave a like, subscribe and comment, thank you for watching.